Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelox Workshop. I'm going to bring you in on the middle of a project. Years ago, my wife bought me a windmill. I had wanted a full-scale windmill and we just couldn't afford it at the time, so she got me this one. And it's been a fond memory of many things. I've repaired it a couple of times and I'm back doing it again. Uh, the high winds here in Michigan sometimes reach 60 miles an hour and the old girl just couldn't handle it. The bearings in the hub were just ball bearings. They weren't designed for side thrust. They do a fine job keeping something rotating, but a fan wheel has a lot of thrust going in one direction. So the bearing actually ate through the side of the race. I wanted to just buy another set of bearings for it, but they're not to be found. After some searching, I stumbled upon a four inch wheel that had ball bearings that are designed to take thrust. These bearings are designed to take the side load without any problems. So I cut the uh, hub out of the wheel, but in order to mount this hub into the fan, I need to cut off this wheel part, which is uh, staked onto the bearing housing. And that brings us over to the South Bend lathe and the chuck that I spent so much time cleaning. With a three jaw chuck, I'm able to lock the hub into the chuck remove this paper tag which is acting like a shim and throwing the hub off in the three jaw chuck.
I want to leave this outer ring of, of the wheel so that I'll have a place to mount the spokes to. So I'm just going to cut off the flange. Three days of work fixing a chuck to do five minutes worth of turning. But next time I have to use a chuck, I'll have it cleaned up and ready to go. It's always good trying to fix something every time you do a project. It's like gaining a new tool. And we all know how I like gaining new tools. Now the space that the hub fits into is in the center of the wheel. And these spokes are what centered the hub inside the fan wheel. But if you can see the ring here, it's a long ways from round. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and spot the hub centered between all the outer edges of the fan blades best I can. Don't get that lucky very often. Can I believe it? But it's actually perfectly aligned just where it is. Never look a gift horse in the mouth. I'm going to clamp it up, take it out and weld it. Just to make sure I don't get a mistake made in the throes of all my excitement over having the part centered, 10 inches. Ten and a quarter. Ten and an eighth. And the three sixteenths. Ten and an eighth. I don't think I'm going to get any closer than that. I should be able to reach down through there with a MIG welder from this side and tack those to the hub and put a tack out here on the end. Then I can take this block off and go in and weld them. Now out to the welding shop. 